Hey guys, how you doing? Thanks so much for joining me today and I must give you a very very warm welcome into my bedroom. So I'm filming somewhere different, I thought this is maybe a little bit cosier, a bit more personal and intimate and this is basically where I get ready every morning. I sit here, perch here on my little stool and I slap on all my makeup and this is where the magic happens and then I look after my skin here, all my skincare's in all of these drawers and I just thought it's a nice background so here we are in my bedroom, so welcome. And today I've got a rather large shoe haul for you. Mm, oh, it's quite heavy, all of this. So yeah, I've got one, two, three, four, five, five boxes to show you and share with you. But before we kick off, I just wanted to say a very massive and heartfelt thank you for the support and the well wishes that you left me on my last video. I've been so, so touched. You've messaged me on Instagram, on Facebook. Friends have WhatsApped me and you've left me the most lovely comments down in the video so I can't thank you enough and I really am so blessed to have such supportive and sweet and thoughtful subscribers and viewers and I do have to pinch myself sometimes that you guys choose to take 10 minutes out of your day and watch my little old videos, little old me and I do have to pinch myself because I think that's slightly crazy because I don't think I'm particularly like interesting or entertaining and I do this like as a hobby really and it's so great that you guys like seem to enjoy it so yeah thank you so much and since I filmed that video um, which was about I think a couple of weeks ago even a month ago even I'm feeling a lot lot better I'm having more good days than bad um, physically I feel so much stronger I'm not aching and having pains and um, I was going through a phase of having quite bad heart palpitations and one time we were away for our anniversary it, ha it was like going on for an, a whole like hour and then you start to panic because you're like why is my heart racing so um, all of that subsided and I'm well I'm fit as a fiddle and um, I'm feeling really positive I feel like I'm the old happy Sammy back and um, excited to film with you and just be with you and chill with you and stuff so yeah I just wanted to say thank you so much I'm very very lucky to have you and it's always good to see the regulars who leave me comments and likes on my Instagram pictures and stuff. It, you, you guys are so, so sweet. So I wanted to thank you so much. And enough of the mushy stuff. I know what you came for. You came to see what shoes I've picked up recently. So let's get into it. So the first pair of shoes I got was from ASOS and it's from a brand called True Decadence. And basically I have a Christmas party coming up. It's my husband's Christmas party and it's quite a swanky do. It's in Mayfair. So I haven't found a dress yet and so because I couldn't find a dress I'm trying to get inspiration from the shoes. So the shoes that I've picked up to wear to the event are these silver glittery sandals. I love them, they're very art deco kind of vintage. I love this kind of peep toe um, detail and this very kind of sparkliness. I just love it. You know me, I love a bit of bling and um, these are just gorgeous. And I, I'm thinking of getting maybe a navy blue dress. Um, they'll really go with like silver, maybe get a silver clutch as well. So I really like these. I got them in a size five and they were 32 pounds. I love buying shoes from ASOS as well because you can often get 20% off, which makes it a lot um, more affordable um, on the more kind of high end shoes. But uh, 32 pounds, very, very reasonable. I like that these, they have a little kind of um, tie at the ankle so they're gonna stay on your feet. Sometimes with stilettos, I find they slip off and I end up having trouble walking in them. So I really love this. So glittery, um, glitzy and just kind of perfect for a special occasion. And because I was really feeling the True Decadence like shoes, I picked another pair and these are definitely very, very different. Oh, they've given me a little dust bag for the shoes, so a little kind of shoe bag, um, which is always a really, really nice touch. I think the last time I got a shoe bag was when I bought my um, Ash boots and it's just a nice added little extra. So props to them for thinking of that. And the shoes that I got, um, are really kind of different from anything that I've like seen. And these are the shoes, so very kind of like um, normal, very general kind of front. But it's when you look at the heel that you're like, wow, they're so, so different. So the heel is kind of like a little bit geometric. It's not smooth or one shape all the way round. It's got a nice kind of shift on ankle straps so that when you put your ankle through it, you do it up and, and the bow just kind of floats down to the floor, which I think is really, really sexy. So I'm hoping these look really nice. They seem really, really sturdy because of the block heel. And um, oh, I'm not quite sure, quite sure what I'd wear these with. Maybe probably not trousers because it would hide the tie details so maybe with dresses so yeah I really really like these I think these are about 32 pounds or 34 pounds as well so like look just just 
totally like different. I really like those. I like things that are slightly different, little bit like edgy, and I think these are elegant shoes, but like with a slight edge because of the heel. So yeah, I really like those, really, really like those. Hoping they're gonna be comfy. And then the third pair of shoes that I picked up were from Lipsy London. Really, really like this box. Very, very luxe. Now, um, I've got a pair of trainers. I only have one pair of trainers, um, which I basically live in all the time because they're so, so comfortable. They're a pair of grey suede, um, I think they're Adidas Gazelle trainers, and I got them for Christmas from my parents last year, and they're so incredibly comfortable. Um, but I think they need to have a bit of a rest because I've kind of worn them a lot, and like with suede, it's really difficult to clean. So the new trainers that I've picked up are these rather blingy. Well, you know me, I love a bit of bling. Um, rose gold trainers from ASOS so they were Lipsy via ASOS and I absolutely love these I popped a picture on my Instagram and I was like do I need these in my life and my friend was like yes you do my friend Natalie so um they're so lovely they're just they're proper bling there's no denying it and some people might think they're a little bit tacky but like I don't really think the rest of my clothes are tacky so maybe I can get away with it if I just wear quite a simple outfit and then I can just bling it up with my shoes, my trainers. So I love these. Rose gold is just like the colour right now and there's a little bit of glitter on the front, on the toe caps, a little bit of glitter on the back and they're just so girly and I can't wait to wear them. I hope that they're comfy. Oh, they don't have like an insole -y bit there where you, the arch of your foot is which I find really helps because um, yeah, I have quite a high arch, so I might have to put an insole in there, but they look promising, they look really comfy, um, and just, the colour is just so, so nice. These, oh, I can't remember where, how, I can't remember how much they were, but, um, I will leave all the links, um, in the description bar below, so you can just click and check them out if you want to, see what they look like on the side, and see how much they are, so... I'll do that for you, no problem. And the fourth and final pair of shoes that I picked up from, yes, you guessed it, ASOS, are, I think, my favourite, because I think I'm gonna wear these the most and get the most wear out of them, because they're kind of like, I would say, like an everyday shoe. Although you might not agree with me, you might think they're like far too outrageous to wear during the day, and they are these black studded mm, sandals. I'd say sandals because sandals, they've got the straps. So yeah, these are proper, like hardcore rock chick, I love them. I love studs, I love zips, and I just love these so much. Um, there's kind of like a leather mock crop kind of pattern on the front. I think the light is picking that up. Studs all the way around the front, all the way up the straps and the back. So there's two straps here, which actually, when I've tried them on, I found that really kind of elongated my leg. So um, really, really happy about that. Because I often find that straps cut off like the base of your foot, your like, leg and they can make you look a little bit stumpier they do on me because I'm not that particularly tall so yeah I like the effect of two straps and I will say when I first saw these on a website I was a bit like I'm not into like a chunky heel I feel like they look a little bit clumsy and a little bit like I don't know 80s I don't know why I think that but actually trying them on and wearing them around the house because I'm trying to wear them in a bit they actually give a lot more like support and I'm less likely to fall over and um, I really like these. I got these in a size 5 and actually I have worn them out. Where did I wear them? I wore them around to my mother and father-in-laws the other day because I wanted to see if they were comfy so yeah I really really like these and again I'm not sure of the price. Hold on let me look. No it doesn't tell me in my delivery note so I will put the price down below but yeah these are super nice good with a dress, a skirt and good with trousers because you can have these kind of peeping out below and it's just, I love this kind of rocky, edgy kind of look. So yeah, oh, so good. Now my final pair of, um, I shall say boots, are from Office. And if you follow me on Instagram or Snapchat, you will know what they are. They are the very, very beautiful, and again, I will say edgy, um kind of chloe savannah boots inspired i don't know i'm not very good with all the like design names but apparently they're like the chloe savannah boots and they are these beauties <gasps> oh i love these they're so nice now when i saw them on the office website i was a bit like Ugh, they look so tacky because the photographs make the um the gold studs here look a lot more kind of blingy and shiny so in real life they're actually a lot more kind of muted they're not so like in your face 
although generally the shoe is quite loud and in your face but you know what I mean if you look on the website so yeah buckle boot with studs um, you put them in there's a little um, can, in, inner zip just here so you pop your foot in do it up and they're so so comfy what I like about them is not only like the general blinginess of it but the heel is not too high and also the soles here are, re are quite like thick so it's I would say in my opinion a really well made boot so I absolutely love these I've worn these to work already Ugh. oh there's something like I think it's like a bit of tomato where I was making a tomato soup the other night Ew. so yes these boots I can't remember I think they're like the studded buckle boot on, on the office website. So if you're interested, they do this in the black leather, in a red leather, in a new buck, and they do it with black and silver hardware. And I literally ordered four pairs of the boots. Um, and I decided on these, I think these are the best. So nice with black jeans. I wore them with my navy jeans and they just didn't go. So I'd say wear them with black. If you do get these, wear them with black. Cause I found with like my navy jeans, I just didn't feel it. I didn't feel the look. So that concludes the shoe haul and what I'll try and do is take small outfit of the day photos and pop them up on my Instagram which is hey Sam Love. so come and add me, say hi and um, I wanted to try and get more into like Instagram stories and um, Snapchat but to be honest with you my life is so dull like I'm a normal everyday working girl, not working girl like that. <laughs> that sounds so wrong as in like I work Monday to Friday I have a very normal very sort of not mundane but just like a office job or hospital job and um, I don't think much happens that is fun in the day that I, it's worth recording and in fact oh hello Mel what have you bought me soup <laughs> he's feeding me with soup I'm just gonna finish up this um, video one sec and um, I think the most interesting thing that will happen to me on, to, on, on a day by day basis is basically what I eat so what I have for lunch and what I have for dinner so I don't think that's really worth like snapping about maybe I don't know I'm just having a little word with myself anyway I must go because I've got some dinner here so um, please remember to like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you very soon in my next one lots of love bye bye